Hey guys, and welcome back to Resident Evil 2. Now, we've got a bit of uh, tyrant trouble. Ugh. God damn it. So, we've attained the parts. Um, that we need. Now, shit. Can't remember where we need to go to. Ah, that's where we had to go. Right, okay, let's do that then. Let's do that. Because he is going to be riding our ass. And I'm assuming we either have a fight with him. Or s something. Yeah, I can hear him. He's still out there. Oh, maybe we've got to examine these first. Um, electronic part. Small electronic part. Do we need two? We do. Fuck nuggets. Thank God. Shit. Um. Mm. Okay. Well, we're gonna have to face the music now. It said about the clock tower. Where's the clock tower? Oh, there. Oh man. Oh man, oh man. So where's the best way? So the roof just leads down to the boiler room. How do we get back to the police station? Because we can't go through there. We can go down. We haven't been to the break room yet. Ah. Hmm. So if we go up, that's locked, but it doesn't tell us why it's locked. Well, I guess he's removed the helicopter for us. So I guess we've got to go through the roof, pick up that herb on the way. And we can go, is he going to chase us into the main hall though? So that's out and up. And then straight out to the balcony. I really want to look in the storage room. But we're not going to have that luxury, are we? Okay. Um, are we too injured for him to chase us? Is the next question. Kind of want a herb as well. Let's just leave it for now. I don't think we're really that much slower. Okay, he's actually fucked off. Which is quite nice. 
Okay, that's cool. Sounds like he's disappeared quite a way away. It's quite cool, actually, that you get to see a fully um, grown tyrant that's operating as it should. Right, can we just walk slowly? Because we don't want to attract him. Can't hear him. So we can go through the waiting room. Let's be quiet now. Really don't need to be pissing him off. Now, obviously, this waiting room is no longer a save room, is it? No. Okay, so we're back into the main hall. I don't really want to have to walk everywhere, though. Because, I mean, that's just slow and annoying. You're right, Claire. You're good. You're right, girl. I wonder how Marvin's doing. Oh, he's still there. Yeah, there, buddy. <laughs> oh. oh God, I guess God. he's zombified now. So we can get into the records room. So, I mean, potentially we could go through the library. Oh, we've got to go through the main hall. How do we go through the main hall, though? We can get into the lending room now as well. How do we get up there? We've got to go through there. Locked door. I'm assuming it's locked from the other side. That's cool. How the fucking hell? We've got the jack. But we've got nothing to use the jack yet. Use with the jack yet. Um... Because that door was just straight up locked. Marvin. Kind of want to kill him. Those footsteps are getting louder. So we can, I mean, we can go through the West Office. Into the dark room, which is another save room. Then we can go upstairs to here. We go through the shower room, past here, through the lounge. Apparently, the lounge has still got stuff in it. But there's no point, though. How do we get to the clock tower? I mean, the only door there is that one. Let's try going to the library. Let's try going to the library. 
Let's see what happens. Guessing the library is not safe from the tyrant. It sounds like wherever he is, he's over here. We still got the jack. We can't use anything. And it sounds like our friend is up here. See, that's the room that we've got to get to. Hey, buddy. Let's find out, shall we? Let's see if he can follow us into the main hallway. Because this should be a safe room. It's not a safe room. Good to know. Alright, Claire. In that case, let's go through here. Let's see if we can get to the dark room. Oh, fuck. We now have liquors. Guys, we now have liquors. Whoa. Fuck. All right. Now, can he get into here? So, we're going to have to kill that liquor. Oh, dear. We need to open that room, I think, because we obviously... Okay, so I'm thinking we need to go into the library. We need to use the item to make a bridge, which is what I'm assuming that... Um, the jack is used for. But whatever we need for the jack, I guess, is either going to be in the linen room, maybe... Or it's going to be in the heart door, uh, in the records room. But, it's more problem. We've got a tyrant chasing us. Where's the liquor? Let's just be quiet about this, guys. Now, flame rounds are not as effective as I hoped. So he's on that wall. Good to know. Right, heart key. Let's use this. Okay, ah, look, there we go, like straight away. Anything else in here? Of course there is. There's going to be loads of stuff. There's a hand grenade. Where's the hand grenade? Hand grenade is there. Still more stuff in here. Oh. That is a zombie trying to get through. Oh, he knows where we are. So let's do the old gentlemanly thing and 
give him the old switch a route. Run! Run, Claire! Run! Ah, oh, fucking hell. I would. Oh, are you kidding? What the fuck? Are you actually serious? We got sliced as we walked in through the door. Oh, wait, what? Change game mode? What was that about? Did I ch change the game mode? Oh, and I'm all the way back here. I mean, we know what we've got to do. Definitely got to kill that liquor for a start. Haven't been in that room yet, or that room. Is... Is Mr. X following us? No, Mr. X is not following us yet. Right, let's abuse this. Because now we can open up a way. Okay. So, what we need to do. We need a save room. Let's go back and sort our stuff out. Because we really screwed up there with Mr. X. And I don't mind admitting that. Now, is there a way to find out like what difficulty we're playing? Because I don't want to be playing it on easy. Fuck! And I did that again. Well, I hope the submachine gun's good. Because it's going to kind of have to be now. Okay. Right. So we can at least now go and... Explore up here in peace. I was going to say, I would quickly run around and do this all off camera and catch up to where we were. But we're going to do something slightly different. Now we know what's coming. We can better prepare ourselves. That door is locked. That's the door... Right, he hasn't noticed us, so that's fine. We can creep around. Oh! Didn't even see that here. Okay, that's good to know. See, this is the difference when you can look around without any pressure of the tyrant. Liquors have been... Ah, flame rounds. And they really have dialed liquors up to 11. They are more than just a hindrance. They are certified ass kickers. Though it's kind of frustrating. Uh, one thing about them is 
like I like the mechanic when you've got a creep around them. I think that's really cool and it works. But you can't really creep around uh, when you're being chased by Mr. X. And we have got the... Yeah, we've got it in here. And that's a huge issue. So in theory, we never have to come in here again. Although we probably will come in here. Because we can use it as a shortcut by the look of things. Which is nice. Now, of course, in the original game, you could down Mr. X. Uh, and he actually dropped stuff for you. Personally, I think that would have been a cool mechanic. Because I have been told that you cannot shoot him. If you do shoot him, he loses his health. Yeah, so basically what's going to happen now, as soon as we go through there, he's going to be on our ass. Which is fine. Let's, let's go back to an item room. Uh, make sure we're only carrying exactly what we need to carry. Although it's probably going to be a lot easier to avoid him once we've started opening up the rest of the police station. Alright, so we're going to drop that down. We want that. Ugh, I said we want that game. Uh, that one, anyone will do. Let's drop you. We'll hold on to that just in case. We will take flame rounds. I can't believe I mixed up more ammo for the submachine gun. That's really annoying. But I'm sure ammo is not going to be an issue. I don't think we need... Oh, we only got two that time. Is there like a bit of randomness? When mixing ammo. Now, in uh, RE3, the more ammo you mixed up, the better you got with it. And you could make the ammo quicker. Uh, not quicker, sorry. You could make more of it. So eventually, like when you first started off, you was making like 15 handgun bullets. But towards the end of the game, if you kept mixing handgun bullets, eventually you'd be making like packs of 28 or something. Okay. Um, right, let's go deal with him again. What was down here? Oh, that was just... Yeah, this. That's fine. There's nothing down here. I mean, there is. There's a room we can't get into, but we'll worry about that another time. Now, trouble is, he when we initiate the encounter with him, he's looking right at us. So we're going to have to, like, run out here or run back up here, get into the save room, hide, and then give him the switch. And not the Nintendo variety switch. Yeah, he's through here. Come on, X. Actually, we can grab that whilst we're here. Oh, buddy. Jesus, yeah, he's not going to stay back, Claire. That's kind of not what he does. He is here for one reason. That's to kill all the stars members. And unfortunately, we're close enough to fit the bill. 
so you're dead by uh, association, I'm afraid. Actually. Can we? Oh, he climbs. Okay, of course. Hello, Mr. X, buddy. Yep. Do down, Claire. Ah, let's dance, motherfucker. Let's dance. Just fucking run, Claire. He's literally right on our ass. I'm guessing when the music stops, he's lost our trail. And I've gone the wrong way. And I'm basing that on pure video game logic. At least we know where we're going. We do need to remove that liquor, which is going to cause issues. And I actually think I'm going to drop a save here, guys. We're actually on 26 minutes here, too. Just because I don't want to keep doing all this over and over and over again. And I'm going to record one more video of this game today. And then I'm going to get my stream on. Right. Yeah. So we need to go to the records room. So we need to run to the records room, which is actually a straight ziggity zag. We need to burn the liquor, because that liquor is going to be a pain. Let's try and do that now. We're not going to disturb Marvin, because he's happy enough just chilling where he is. Sounds like he's near bit unfair that he always seems to be where you need to be. There's our liquor friend. I want to kill it though. Let's run to our dark room. I think he's dying. Nope. Nope. The liquor is not dying. Ah, shit. That liquor needs to die. Liquor is not dead. I don't think. Or is he dead? I'm not sure. Oh yeah, bon appetit. Liquor is dead. Okay. So, <laughs> one step forward, guys. One step forward. <sighs> when we come back, we've got to make it to the records room. We've got to pick up what we need. And then we need to get to the library. We need to create the bridge. Run across. And find these parts. Hmm. <laughs> possibly more liquors everywhere. And possibly having our tyrant friend on our ass the whole time as well. Hoping he's not going to come into this room. Hmm. <laughs> Anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. When we return, you know the deal. Till then, guys. Till then.